I actually started in the title industry in 2008, and my standing joke is I joined at the absolute best possible time, right as the market was tipping over for the Great Recession. The first quarter under my tenure as CFO was the worst financial performance in Stewart's 130-year history. So I felt like I had nowhere to go from there but up. <laughs> I left Stewart uh, late in 2017. I didn't really expect to go back into the title industry, so it was, you know, must have been a sign from above. People knew of Patton in terms of being this aggressive fee attorney office, which it was at the time, right? And I ended up joining Patton in June of 2019. One of the initial appeals was throughout my career, I have spent time in companies very large and very small. And I always found that I enjoyed the smaller companies more because there was just that sense of intimacy there's more risk taking involved and that's appropriate as you get bigger and more bureaucratic you become almost afraid to make a decision at Patton in particular we're not afraid to make decisions and we make them quickly we don't agonize over decisions we don't form a committee and you know have 12 people sitting around a table once a week trying to make a decision over something and I think that that gives Patton a nimbleness that most of the larger companies don't have, either because they've got this bureaucratic structure that demands a different decision-making process, or they're just afraid. And I don't see us being afraid to make decisions. And on top of that, you felt like it's easier to make a difference in a company that's kind of up and coming. I've seen a lot over the course of my career, and a lot of companies give lip service to their employees. We love you and we take care of you every single day, but Patton really does. It's remarkable the things that we do for our employees and our offer our employees. And uh, we put forth a tremendous amount of effort in terms of just making sure our employees know that they are valued. Not that we want them to think they're valued, we want them to know they're valued. And I think uh, the effort that we put into that is pretty remarkable.